In today's video, I'm going to be showing off a program that is called Proton Up QT. So it's right there. You can just call it, I guess, Pup GUI. And I grabbed it from the AUR. You can also grab it from FlatHub and you can grab it from GitHub. They have releases for app images, RPMs, multiple different things, probably .debs. So it should be very easy for you to grab this and use this on any distro. Now we are back on GNOME recording uh, for specific reasons. It, it has to do with video editing. Still can't video edit on Q on uh, on the Qt Fish OS desktop environment, and I had to record this re-record re this video. So let's get on with it. So you could go here and add a version and choose any version that you want to. As you can see, it has every single version he has ever made. And I'm hoping to see some Wine uh, 7 based Proton builds soon. I would love that. And since we already have one currently installed, you just hit the install button. It will download it from GitHub and it will install it to the proper folder. And that's pretty much it. And if you want to install something with Lutris, it's the same thing. You add version, you choose your version, you hit install. And of course, it will start downloading that version. And once that version is done downloading, it will install it to the right folder by extracting it and then moving it to where it needs to be. This is awesome. This makes grabbing the best tools available for gaming and making it super easy. Now, I'm not saying it wasn't easy before. You just have to download and extract to a certain folder. But this way, this saves you so much more time. And there's not really much else to say about it. The developer's really cool. Uh, I guess they put a lot of hard work into this. Uh, there's a lot of empty space here. I can get why it shows up really small. It's just a simple application to help make things go forward. But yeah, there it is. So I will link uh, this tool in the description below, along with a the ways that you can donate if you want to help get this laptop to 30 gigs of RAM so I can do better videos on emulation and other stuff. Uh, so check for those links in the description below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share the video, and I'll see you guys in the next Linux video, which I don't know when that will be, hopefully soon. It depends on what cool stuff comes out for Linux. See you guys next time.